today we're gonna jailbreak iOS 7.12 running on an iPhone 4G well um, it's not so hard these days to jailbreak it but uh, unfortunately it's not in a DFU mode way anymore meaning that if you for instance uh, install 7.12 on a phone that uh, yeah, that you lost the SIM card from or you don't know what SIM card it's pointing to or need, it's needing to activate then uh, and it's probably also uh, locked to some provider then you will have a kind of problem because uh, with 6.16 and 6.13 we could you know put the phone into a, a DFU mode and at least you know jailbreak it tethered or untethered uh, and then get into the home screen and at least use the phone as a computer but now uh, with 7.12 the update you can uh, not do that anymore so they made a nice little tool it's called Pangu and you need a special version it's called uh, it's the version I think let's take a look at it I just got it here we're on my Mac by the way and I need to download the carrier update okay and we get to set this up as a new iPhone I'm gonna put this there for you guys so you can see what's crackalacking the first thing that you should do is go to date if you want this you know to go really fast put the date on the 2nd of June 2014 so let's do that real fast and then I'll okay check this what you're gonna do is you're gonna remove the set automatically and then here you're gonna look for buying that's China by Ying here China the time zone and then uh, the date you will just go all the way down to the 2nd of June September August July June there we are oh not you baby the second of May oh we went to oh, oh wait for okay there we are the second of June you see that so we go back and what is the date we go to date you see it's the second of June 2014 so now we're gonna get started there and we're gonna close iTunes and we're gonna start up Pangu, Pangu version 1.20. Alright, so there it is. Here you can see the jailbreak tool, and here you can see the phone. I'll put the jailbreak tool a little bit up so you can see what's happening. And then now we just hit jailbreak. Injecting bundles, please wait. Hope you can all see it. Okay, I'll see it. Yeah. Oops, you gotta stay awake, my friend. Let's hit it to the home screen. There you go. Please tap the pangu icon. So here's a pangu icon. We're gonna tap it. <clears throat> we say continue. And it's progressing. Please wait a few minutes. Not too many minutes. I hope. Error! Oh my god! Just kidding. Take it easy. Please back up your device before jailbreak. Pango will not cause any problems. But we cannot make any guarantees. Use Panga at your own risk. That means, you know, if you break your phone now, you cannot get your money back, people. You lost all warranty. Apple don't even want to talk to you because you are a bad person. You are jailbreaking your phone. And why are you doing it? Because you want to do bad things. You want to download programs and, and, and do mean things. Well, that's not it. You know, um, jailbreaking your device doesn't necessarily mean that, you know, you're going to run illegal programs because I don't do that at all. I jailbreak the device to see how it, you know, and then I put it back to original because 
I'm not really using jailbreak devices to, you know, do personal things or whatsoever. The phone that I'm filming with is my iPhone 6. Well, <laughs> it will not be jailbreaked at all, you know. My previous phone, the iPhone 4S that I was using, I never jailbreaked it. I have devices for that, you know, for the jailbreaking thing. And there, keep device connected and do not close the app. You hear that, peeps? And we're just gonna wait a few minutes. Well, you know, I don't want you to wait all these minutes because you're watching some screen. So I'll get back to you when this is. Device is rebooting, peeps. And uh, it's rebooting the device. It's also written up there. So let's see what's gonna happen. If everything goes right, we will have a CDA installed and everything will work as a charm. I think we'll have to do some more steps, but as you could see, everything showed itself. Eh? You only saw the process going on, but in fact, we didn't do anything. Make sure your device, oh yes, make sure that you have no password or whatsoever on the device, eh, peeps. If you put in some lock, you got to remove that. I had to say that at the beginning of this video, but I hope that you first watch the video before you do, watch before you do. And I think we are now pretty much unlocked. What should we do? Uh, processing jailbreak files. Okay, it's, it's still busy. And there we go, uh, storage almost full, oh my gosh, how can it be? It cannot be, how can it be almost full? <laughs> There's nothing on this phone. Done. Okay, it's uh, rebooting peeps. And I think... Uh, in two minutes from now, you know, uh, the whole uh, CDA thing will be installed and everything will be there. And what's to the, the iPhone plug, darling, that could not be synced, bloody, bloody, blah, blah. Okay, cool. Never mind. So, we're gonna let this boot and then I'll get back to you. Okay, peeps. It says uh, iPhone 3.1 already jailbroken. So, let's see what we got. And uh, CDA installed, CDA working and up. Preparing file system. So, this is it, peeps. Um, yeah, we're jailbroken now. So, yeah, that's how to uh, jailbreak your iPhone 4, also your iPhone 4S, and also I think your 5 if you're on 7.12. I think, yeah. Most of you are on iOS 8. iOS 8 is really great. Uh, it also runs good on the iPhone 4S. I had that running on the 4S, so I could not really complain about it. Uh, I see no reason why you should downgrade. Uh, for iPhone 4, this is the highest what you can get, 7.12. And uh, we can also easily jailbreak it, as you could see. Uh, well, I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to restore it back to original you got to remember that if you want to restore it back to original uh, the only way to do that is to first put it into the fu mode and then uh, restore it with itunes point your itunes to the 7.12 original firmware of the of the phone and then restore it and then you know it will be restored and you will be back to original. So this is it, peeps. Thanks for watching. If you think this information was kind of useful, hit this video a like. And of course, subscribe to my channel for videos of all kinds. Oh yeah, by the way, I want to say thank you to Pangu team, my friends there in China. Well done. Thank you.